I'm going to show you how to do a while loop. First of all, I have an integer called num, and I want to print the numbers from 1 to 10. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to initialize num, and I'm going to say num equals 1. All right. Now, I want to have a while loop. So I do while, and then I have a condition. So while this condition is met, so while num is less than or equal to 10, I'm going to do whatever's inside of these curly braces. So what I'm going to do? Well, first of all, I want to print the number. So I'll do std c out and I'll put num right here. And then I will print out my end line. All right. And then what this would do, if I left it right here, it would sit there and print the number one forever. So let's go ahead and, well, run that and see what happens. I run the code and it just starts printing the number one and that's good. And we don't really want that to happen. So I'll go ahead and stop the execution. Okay. If I want it to end, I have to do something to make it so this condition will eventually end. So I'm going to do num plus plus. So I'm add one to num, and then it will print out the number until it gets to 10. So go ahead and run it again. And I print the numbers from one to 10. And this is a while loop. So remember, if you want to have a while loop, it's good to make sure you initialize the numbers or your condition, make sure you have a test and it runs everything. As long as this test meet, meets the criterion and it's true, it will run everything inside of this and then go and try running it again, checking the test again and making sure the criteria is true and keep running it. And this is how you write a while loop.